Hey guys, it's Andy from The Weary Chef, and today I'm going to show you how to make a really easy chicken pot pie or turkey pot pie in about 30 minutes. Okay, so for this quick chicken pot pie, you're going to need chicken. Um, I'm just using shredded rotisserie chicken from the grocery store. This would also be really good um, with leftover Thanksgiving turkey. You're going to need Campbell's soups for easy cooking. This is a new product. These are made just for recipes. And actually this chicken pot pie recipe is on the back of this um, creamy herb and garlic flavor. So you can just pick up the soup at the store and see everything you need right there on the back. Um, and then we have frozen mixed vegetables, which are thawed. You can put them on your counter for a couple hours um, or put them in the refrigerator the night before you make this. So I've got my chicken and vegetables here. I'm going to pour in my soup. It smells garlicky and herby. Okay. And then just stir that all together. You can stir it right in the pie pan, but I um, sprayed my pan with cooking spray. It just seemed better to do in the bowl. My husband does the dishes at home. Okay, so then you're going to just pour this right in here. This is kind of a big pan, so it might be a tight to cover it with the crust. This beautiful pan was a Christmas gift last year from my husband, I think, because he wanted more pie. Okay, so we've got that in there. And then I've got my already mixed up baking mix. So, like I said, this is kind of a big pan, so we'll see how much this is going to cover. I'm just going to use my fingers. I think that'll be easier. So I'm just going to spread this over the top and then we're going to bake it for 25 minutes. Okay, it's been about 30 minutes. Our pot pie's out of the oven. It has a beautiful golden brown top. It smells delicious. It's going to be a great dinner and I love how quick and easy it was. I hope you loved this one too, and I'd love to hear from you in the comments to know how you liked having a video. Um, maybe I'll add more videos to The Weary Chef. Thank you so much for watching.